I'm going to do random pulls for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. This exercise is called random pulls because we're going to get 28 or 27 tiles. Player one gets 28, player two gets 27. And then we're going to identify the strength in those dealt tiles. Once you identify the strength, you can figure out which categories to play, identify your discards, and hit the ground running, because there's no Charleston. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. I'm going to use these dice to randomize which player we are. Odd will be player one, even will be player two. I rolled an 11, we're going to be player one. 28 tiles. We have a joker, two dragons. News with multiples, a pair and a pung. We have cracks, two multiples, three and four. Four dots, singles, six bams, two pair, seven, nine. So if these were your tiles, what would you focus on and what would be your first discards? If these were my tiles, I think I would try for maybe a quint, consecutive quint. Three, four, five, six. Pair, pung, kong, quint. We need to build up for sure. But that this would allow for a news year hand. We wouldn't need this. News year hand. Second hand down. I would keep the West though, because if the year tiles don't come in, the two, we could play news concealed if we can get flowers. And then here I would play maybe the first quint but I think what I would do is hold the one. If that doesn't come in, we could play one through five. First consecutive hand. Use these as joker bait. Discard those. With Siamese Mahjong, because you have so many tiles to work with, you can actually pick a hand right away. If you leverage the strength of the hand, you can take it to a win more times than not. Here, our multiples didn't quite work together. Three, four, or seven, nine. Since we're missing fives in that suit, I don't think I would try that. We potentially could play five, seven, seven, nine, but this is really light. Maybe hold it just to see what happens. If we went with five, seven, seven, nine, we would have to discard three, four. So maybe hold these for a while. Start by discarding those. If we could get a north, we could use this up here, and this would be two away from ready. And again, we wouldn't need that, but I would still hold it and gather. Gather wins and maybe play the first hand under Winds and Dragons or the Concealed Hand. Just gather all the options for whatever category you're playing. You know what I was just thinking? There is a potential for three, four, five, six, six. Joker bait discards three, four, five, 
six, six. That would be the fourth hand down. Maybe hold these for a little while. Consecutive options. We even have five, seven, seven, nine. I would discard those first. I rolled an even, so we're going to be player two. We have three jokers, single north-south, pair of red dragons, pung of white dragons. We have a consecutive run with a pair of fours. There's an eight there. A pair of flowers, five dots including a pair of nines, two, three, eight singles. If these were your tiles, what would you focus on? And what would be your first discards? If these were my tiles, I would play the Dragon Year hand and consecutive run three, four, five, six, two suits. Eight discards. Joker bait. This is super light, but this is set. We could Kong, Kong, ready to win on a nine. Use this down here, because this is really bleak. Maybe even hold the five. Maybe even hold the two, three. Two, three, four, five, three, four, five, six options. Still joker bait. I think that's what I would do here. Year hand, consecutive run. The year hand would be third one down under the year. This one would be the second one down with options. Two, three, four, five, or three, four, five, six. We could maybe even do three, four, five, mix suit Kongs if we get flowers. But that second hand down requires no flowers and that way we can use it up here. I rolled a four. That's an even number so we're going to be player two. 27 tiles. Look at all those cracks. We have a couple jokers, one of each of the dragons, almost one of each of the winds. We need a west to complete news. Here we have cracks with a pung and a pear. Here we have six dots with a pair, single bams. If these were your tiles, what would you focus on and what would be your first discards? If these were my tiles, I would play two, four, six, eight with dragons and a year hand with news. The year hand with news 
is going to need some work. Yikes. 12 discards. We do have Joker bait. 10 discards with Joker bait. But we have no gaps here. This is going to be a challenge because we're using the two up here and that needs to be a pair. I think this is good. This is a problem. We need options. Year hand with dots. North and south with dragons. We're using dragons there. Nix. We do have a lot of five, seven, nine. Okay, we have a plan B and plan C. <laughs> we have two, four, six, eight with dragons. This would be the fifth hand down under, this would be the second hand from the bottom under evens. Here, five, seven, nine pair hand, keep this then. Five, seven, nine pair hand. It's bleak, I know. Or a year hand. Keep the one as an option. Either way, I would want to try to use this. There's a pung there. Maybe keep the fours and the dragon. Discard those first. Because if we draw well with two, four, six, eight, maybe we could use the dragons with like numbers as another option. Five, seven, nine year hand, two, four, six, eight in one suit, or like numbers with fours. This is going to take a lot of fancy footwork. I would keep all this, discard those. If you are new to Siamese Mahjong, I highly recommend that you start with random pulls. If you don't have a set at home, look for a link in the video description below for one that I highly recommend through Gam in a Village. Not sponsored. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table between now and the next set of random pulls for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules, may all your picks be keepers.